Have you ever wished that there was an easy way for you to be able to compare stocks on your Google Sheet and Excel spreadsheet? In this video, you will learn how to get and use a free stock comparison spreadsheet that allows you to easily compare companies and stocks across key metrics, financials, and real-time data. Okay, so before I show you how to get the free stock comparison spreadsheet, let me just quickly show you how it works and the value that you can get from it. So starting off, as you can see, we have different companies. So we have all these different companies right here and we have a whole bunch of key metrics. Some of them are historical key metrics. Some of them are TTM key metrics and some of them are real time data. The cool thing about this free stock comparison spreadsheet is that the way it works is very simple. You can add more metrics on this side and I'm going to talk more about that. You can also add more companies on this side, but this is the cool thing. You can simply change the company ticker. And as you can see, the data will be automatically updated for you. Now, in terms of how the spreadsheet works, the way it works is super simple. So as you can see, it uses this custom function, the wise price function, which comes from Y sheets. And this is an add-on that you can download on Google Sheets and Excel. You can create a free trial account so you can test it out for yourself. And as you can see, the way the function works is very simple. You can see on the page once you download the add-on how the function works. So the way it works is simple. It takes all these different real-time parameters right here. And it takes all these different companies right here. And then it gives you the data. So if I click enter, the data will be automatically refreshed because this is real time data. You can also press the button here and the data will also refresh this way. Now to see what data is available, you can click here and you will be able to see all the different data points that are available for the wise price function and for the wise function, which I'm going to talk about next. Now, when it comes to the WISE function, this is typically used to get historical stock financial ski metrics and growth metrics. But the cool thing about the function is that you can see how it works here, but you can access TTM data. So that includes the trailing 12 months of data. And that is really helpful for particular key metrics like this, because based on the fundamentals or based on the company's price, for example, the company is constantly being updated. This allows you to remove the seasonality of the company's fiscal years and compare companies in a much better way. As you can see, the WISE function is also being used here to get all these different key metrics for all these companies. And just like I showed you before, if you go here, click on it, the data will be automatically refreshed. And just like the WISE price function, you can click here to see the supported data points and see all the different data points that are covered, including companies financials like the income statement the cash flow statement the balance sheet key metrics and growth metrics now before i show you how to get the free stock comparison spreadsheet for free what i want to show you is how you can add additional companies or tickers or stocks to your list so in this case this is very simple all you have to do is just enter the company ticker so we'll put apple back again and then here you just have to adjust the different functions so in this case, we can see the data that this function is taking. So what we can do is copy this. Well, we could do it from scratch, but the easy way is to just copy this, put it here, and then expand this so the number shows. And then you just have to make sure you're getting the right data. So we're getting Apple, the right ticker, and this is the right parameters, TTM, perfect. And you can also do the same for all these different companies here. So here, I'm gonna put this here. And as you can see, this should be working well. The only exception is the wise price function where you just have to adjust the parameters because this can provide you with all the data for all these companies at once, which is really cool. So as you can see, we have everything except this is not covering Apple. So therefore, all we need to do is extend it. And as you can see, it is that easy to be able to add this specific data to your stock comparison spreadsheet. As you can see with this information, you can build any type of stock comparison spreadsheet. So in this case, we have a whole bunch of different companies and we have all this important key metrics that we're looking at. 
And with Ysheets, just like I showed you before, using the functions, you can set up your spreadsheet in any way you like. So you can get all these different key metrics, financials, fundamentals, all of it right on your spreadsheet. So you, in one view, you can compare companies a lot easier. And you can also do any types of mathematical operations, calculations, graphing. It's really all up to you. With that being said, the easy way to get this free stock comparison spreadsheet is very simple. All you have to do is download Y Sheets. Again, this can be done on Excel and Google Sheets. The way you do that is simple. You go on insert on Excel, click on get add-ins, look for Y Sheets, download it. And then here you can download uh, here you can sign in with your free trial account and once you're signed in you can go to wise templates and you will see right here uh, key key metric stock comparison excel you click here it's going to download a file for you that already has the formulas and the spreadsheet in place and you will be able to use the template with any issues just make sure that just make sure that you have uh, Y sheets open and you're logged in the only thing you need to know is that for you to be able to get the data, you need to have a full Y Sheets account. If you don't have it, you will be able to get all this data, but only for Apple, Tesla, and Amazon. And the last thing, which is really cool, is that besides this uh, free stock comparison spreadsheet, we have a whole bunch of other different templates that you can check out. So we have a portfolio tracker, a DCF, earnings power value model, uh, hypercharts, stock comparison graphs again you can download all of these templates for free and then make any modifications you would like to do so there you have it if you enjoy this video please make sure to give it a like and subscribe and turn the notifications bell on so you get notified when we create new spreadsheet templates new valuable videos that are going to allow you to ultimately become a better stock market investor i'll see you in the next video